Sister Anna Teresa Nyadombo of the Enemies of Our Age of Mount Carmel in Zimbabwe. My topic, which I'm sharing with you, is a vital church in Africa. Who is this that I hear for? These were echoing words from King Herod during the time of our Lord Jesus Christ when King Herod was puzzled to hear that our Lord was waking and performing wonders about healing people, converting people, and also including even the outcasts to follow him. So he was so amazed to say, what sort of king is this one? To Herod, he was king of the king, like all kings in the world. But the discussion we have, the reflection we have on Vital Church in Africa is a church which is modeled on the footsteps of Jesus. A church being called to live like Christ. Africa has a background of so many challenges. We have wars, we have experienced droughts, disasters, we have experienced child abuse. We have also experienced a shortage of food uh, through poverty. And also, we have also found out that in Africa, there is high rate of migrants, people leaving Africa for greener pastures, people being trafficked uh, for profit making. And also in Africa, we have seen that it is still a dark continent where people are searching God. They don't understand sometimes who God is. So the third part of my discussion is highlighting that a vital church is a church bear where everyone is being invited to walk in the footsteps of Christ. Christ was full of charity. Christ was full of love and also Christ who understood the work of God. He listened to his father as a church. Nowadays, we are reflecting on snot on synodality, where we are being called to unite and to participate.